Hey everybody, Brandon here from CAD Intentions. In today's video, I'm going to show you how to use the AutoCAD Design Center uh, as an easy way to move styles, lines, blocks, um, anything you kind of would save in a drawing. You can move them from one drawing to another pretty quickly and easily. Uh, this way, if you've got a drawing from a client or you're setting up a new drawing and you want to copy a bunch of styles and uh, blocks in from an old version of that file or maybe another project that was similar, uh, you can use Design Center to easily just add them to your new drawing. Uh, so let's get started. So you can see here I've got a blank drawing uh, called Drawing 2. This has nothing in it and I'm going to show you that by bringing up the, the Design Center. So you can do that by typing in AD Center and you can see now we've got the Design Center window, window open and it's from here where we're able to copy all of these uh, different styles into the drawing that we're working in. So the key here to remember is to launch or to use uh, Design Center in the drawing that you want to bring things into. So this will be your the one you're working on. Um, I like to use the Open Drawings tab. Uh, so that means I'll open up the drawing that I want to copy things from. And, and that way uh, it's really easy to find, you've, especially if you've only got the two drawings to open. So you're in the drawing you want to copy to, and you've got the drawing that you want to copy from open as well. That way you can just click open drawings and those are the two that show up. If you don't want to open them or you want to copy from multiples, you can just open up folders and then browse through your uh, network or your C drive and find the drawings you want to copy from. You can also use history if you use a template or standard file uh, to bring styles from. That's another option. I don't have anything in the history because this is a fresh install on my new computer, uh, which if you haven't seen the new computer video, make sure you check that one out. Uh, it's my custom CAD PC built by XI Computers. This thing's been awesome. Uh, it's handled everything I've thrown at it and more, and it's, uh, it's really good. So check it out. All right, so let's bring in uh, some line types and some blocks. Because you can see in drawing two, I'm going to open up the tab here, that for blocks, all we have are the uh, standard title blocks that I have in my template. And for line types, we only have four, uh, five different options here. You can see in road example that we have a bunch of line types. So I'm going to grab a few of these and I'm going to bring them into drawing two. And to do that, all you're going to do is select in your, your uh, template drawing here, line types, and we're going to grab cable TV and I'm going to hold control and click to grab more than one. We're going to grab electric, storm, telephone, sanitary, and water, let's say. So now all you need to do is right click and hit add line types. You can see now if we go to drawing two and then line types, they've all been added to our drawing two drawing. Those weren't in there before. So now if we went back to our drawing and drew a line, this drawing had no line types in it. Now if we bring up the properties and go line type, you can see it's got all of these options. None of these were there before, which is pretty cool. Now. We can also do the same thing for blocks, uh, detail view styles, dim styles. Dim styles is a nice one because they're kind of time consuming to make. So if you don't have like an annotative one or your custom ones, you can bring them in from other drawings. You can bring in X refs, table styles, multi leaders, uh, pretty much anything. So we're going to grab a few blocks because our drawing up here doesn't have many. So we're going to grab a drainage manhole. And we're just going to say insert block. You can call it drainage manhole. Um, you can give it a point or you can just insert it in at zero, zero. So now you can see that we were able to just grab a drainage manhole block from the other drawing. And now it's in here and you can place it wherever you want. You can delete it. And now if you hit insert, it'll be on your list of blocks that are available. 
So you can do this for multiple, let's see, I've inserted it again. You can do this for multiple blocks. You just select it, insert block. Uh, we'll just put it 10 above the other one. And you can see there's our tree block. So once you bring those in, you can delete them and then insert them whenever you need them using the I command. And now they've been added to your drawing. So that's how you use Design Center uh, really quickly uh, in AutoCAD. It can be super helpful to bring in, I like it for line types, layouts, and blocks. Uh, but as you saw, there's plenty of options. Uh, if you have any questions, make sure you leave them below in the comments. And thanks for watching. Cheers. Thanks for watching the video. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, be sure to check out my last video right here. Uh, and don't forget to subscribe up here to make sure you're up to date and you see all my new videos. Thanks again. Cheers.